I'm Dennis Mercer from Sandy Hook Yacht Sales. Today we're aboard a brand new Sabre 45. I'm with Lynn Baduan, National Sales Director. Lynn, I would like for you to tell me some of your ideas that came about. I love the mid-level galley because it allows your passengers and whoever's making drinks and food to stay engaged with the with the party, but tell me, how did you guys come up with this concept? So the concept of the mid-level galley really started with our uh, heritage model, the Sabre 42, which originally started as a Sabre 40. What we did with this 45 mid-level galley is really fantastic. It has a lot of great features in that you actually have two drawer refrigeration forward with a freezer. So everything you need to make yourself very comfortable in the galley, whether it's snacks or dinner, is at your fingertips and at an arm's reach. And like you said, we can still converse very comfortably. It's a two-state room boat with two heads. Yes. And that is a lot for a boat this size. So one of the things that my customers really enjoy is all this natural light. That's a big deal on a boat because the last thing you want is to feel like you're stuffed in a box. You don't feel that way down here. Right. This is a 45 foot yacht that has a lot of space and it's open, it's airy, a lot of natural light. So was that something you guys were thinking about when you did this boat? That was a huge focus in the design of this boat right from the beginning. What you notice is you have a lot of headroom in this boat and, and it makes it very comfortable and very airy. What we didn't want you to feel like is if you were coming down in a cave. For that reason, you see that there's another opening port right above the head of the bed, which illuminates the forward part of the master stateroom and then opening ports everywhere that we can put them so that you get plenty of natural daylight down below. So Lynn, one of the things that I will say, and I think we're we see these boats differently as I have a lot of stick time. Uh, one of the things I enjoy about this boat are the sight lines. It jumps up, gets on a plane very quickly, rides flat. It's about three degrees rise angle yes. from plane. Um, also, you have the controller right here built into the arm pad. And also with the new uh, dock assist, Volvo dock assist is very good for a boater that's Maybe not everybody wants to admit they're a novice boater, but the dock assist makes it so easy that anybody can do it. And it takes the stress and the, and the heartache out of, oh God, am I gonna get my boat in the slip? It's so easy. It's so user-friendly. The Volvo glass cockpit is so cool. It's, it's very user-friendly. It's the most dynamic system that you could buy on a boat. What we saw as a manufacturer in the Volvo Garmin package is that Volvo is continually investing in their product and they cover everything from the screens to the trim tabs. What I really love is that the system's so intuitive that they all talk to one another and you don't have individual systems that are competing with one another. So Lynn, one of the things that I love about the Sabre product all the way around, not just the 45, but the nice wide walkways, the solid intermediate rail, there's plenty of grabs. So when you leave the cockpit, you're grabbing and hold something solid. You've got plenty of things to hold on to. It's safe. The tow rail is not just aesthetic, it's also a safety feature. Yep. And, and you go look at some of these other manufacturers and they don't either, they don't have intermediate rail or they have a cable there. We have a solid intermediate rail on our bow railing on every model that we have. And I think it's a nice feature. People feel safe and you know, if your husband or your wife is out gonna do the lines, they're not yes. feeling precarious, it's, it's a good feel. Yes, and that is, that is key to Sabre also because while boating is fantastic and boating is fun, boating also needs to be safe. And you also all have to be safe on the water. So anything we can do to contribute to that, that's what we're going to do as standard on our boats. Thank you for your time today, Dennis. Have a great day. <laughs> oh, God, you should have got that, dude. <laughs>